welcome to Ikate's Crossing. Okay, we're going to do the horoscope spread. And this comes from this book, The Ultimate Excitopedia of Fortune Telling. Oops, let's remove that. So it comes from this book here, The Ultimate Excitopedia of Fortune Telling. Okay, so it's quite a large spread. So I'm going to use the my mini steampunk just to show you the layout because I don't really have a huge space with the camera at this time. So let's have a look at the um, spread. Okay, so we know it's 12 cards. And let's do this. Number one is the um, personality. The second card is personal values. And monetary matters. So to do with money. Third is communication and short journeys. Fourth is home and family. Oh, so let's try and bring this up a bit. Fifth is romantic creativity and children. Six is vocation and health. Seventh is relationships. Eighth is shared resources. Ninth is long journey and mass matters of philosophical. Tenth is career goals. Career goals and aspirations. Eleven is friends and hopes. And the twelfth card is the unconscious mind and hidden limitations. So the first card is personalities. I've got the ace of pentacles here. So it's talking about a sense of understanding my own potential. Maybe nurturing health, finances, okay, personal values and monetary matters. So here we've got the King of Cups, it's an interesting one. Do with maybe your remote, putting your emotions to one side. Maybe your goals, reaching your goals and dreams. Right, third, communications and short journey. Two of cups. Connections with others. That's an interesting one. Fourth, home and family. That's interesting. Judgment card came up. Fifth is romance, creativity, and children. Which is the tower. Ooh, that's an interesting one. Feels like boundaries are being. Hmm. Vocation and health. Page of Swords. Okay. Okay, number seven is relationships. Eight of swords, that's interesting, feeling trapped. Now, relationships doesn't necessarily mean intimacy, but relationships are relationships on all levels. Because I'm not in a romantic relationship, and that was romance was the fifth card. Which 
is interesting here. Okay, eight is shared resources with nine of wands. It's an interesting one. Okay, oh, eight. Number nine is the long journeys and philosophical is the emperor. That's interesting. Um, number 10, career goals and aspirations, which is two of cups. That's interesting. It's Ten of Cups, sorry. That one was Ten of Cups there. This is Two of Cups here. So if Ten of Cups was Communications and Short Journeys. And Two of Cups is the Career Goals and Aspirations. So connecting with others. Okay, Eleventh is Friends and Hopes, which is Ace of Swords. And the twelfth card is Unconscious Mind and Hidden Limitations, which is the Six of Pentacles. What an interesting spread. Okay, I'm going to take a photo of that and add that to my tarot journal so I can do a bit of reflection. I just wanted to show you quickly a uh, spread that you could try for yourself the horoscope spread based on the 12 houses of the zodiac so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve okay so that's it from me don't forget to check the links down below check the links on my channel like subscribe and ring the bell so you know when the next video will be uploaded take care and blessed be